Hi everyone, today we will be recreating this viral reel on CapCut which was made by Edit with Madhav. Okay, let's keep it aside. In the beginning, uh, what we have to do is first we'll make the ratio 9 is to 16 which is the vertical format. So as you can see the background, let's bring our background here. Okay, now we have to write text. And choose this font, make it bold. I can, you know, just deselect uniform scale and increase the height a bit now I'll increase the font size and make it all caps put it here and make it red now with black background this text will come in the middle so Let's make this color white, select our background and make it black. Okay. I have also provided in the description the audio for this okay so make sure when you are starting the edit just download everything from the assets okay so this will open up to the right put the text and this image will come up so just go to animation select type to animation and increase the duration yeah so the middle text choose blur right for that and the big text you can just do type 2 and just increase the duration okay Now let's bring our image. This is simple animation of sliding up. So let's bring it down. Sorry, bring it here like this. Hit on transform keyframe. Go ahead. Again hit on transform keyframe. Now go to the first keyframe and drag it down. Now hit Alt plus K to open this. And now smoothen the can and keyframe animations. Okay. Just select your you know image, go to adjustment and play around with some settings. Yes, you have got that look.
just maybe decrease some particles yes and increase vignette okay now after that it will go down so when this comes up just I can also do one thing just select your background and increase the vignette of background too yes yes so once this comes up select everything okay and cut it okay and keep your background steady just select your images then do the animation now i'll bring my red background as you can see it is changing color to red so when it is going back just put my red background here okay. to make it shorter and I'll go to animation, go to out, select fade out, and here I'll select fade in. And just overlap them a bit. As you can see, color changing transition is done. Okay. Now let's cut this part we don't need it now on to the next now this image will come and this text so let's bring the image let's put it here okay make it smaller hit on transform keyframe go ahead again hit on transform keyframe now go to the first keyframe and pull it down. Now hit Alt plus K to open this. Then smoothen out the keyframes again. Drag the handles for a smoother, you know, animation. Now I will grease, uh, make it farther apart the keyframes. Yes. And the text will come now. Change the animation to fade in. Okay. It is coming word by word. What you can do is just make two separate text layers and add the fade in animation separately. So you will get word by word animation. Then as you can see, for two to three frames, it becomes white, okay? So in fast motion, it looks something like this. So what we can do is just go to text, bring in default layer, hit windows plus dot key to open this tab, then select this square. Now I'll make the square bigger. 
okay so let's keep this for three frames and cut it or let's do it five frames yes now let's see what else is there so when this white it becomes black this text and this becomes something like orange okay so go here okay when this starts cut the text and make it black and i cut this again here okay now just cut this too from here now bring this orange symbol of lipstick put it here let's make it smaller what we can do is just select this go to adjustment tab and again add some vignette okay add some particles okay now it's looking much better we can do this with this image also okay now as you can see it turns for this and then next frame comes so let's bring our next grid image bring it down a bit also bring our declining line and put it behind zoom this and just place it properly yes now again do the text which is very simple okay just i'll tell you how to do this animation of grid going down so what you can do as there is no trim paths like after effects in capcut so to make this going down animation the best way you can do is just go to video around to mask okay and hit add mask hit on split then increase the feather a bit okay. now hit on the keyframe go somewhere around here let me increase the my background and then bring it down now you can see you have got that animation now we just hit alt plus k to smoothen it out okay so you have got this animation now just do the text okay then there is this animation you know of background coming in and spreading out so it's very easy just the background which i made earlier just copy it over here expand it okay then what you can do is i will cut it out first make it a compound clip 
then head on to video mask head on frame strip turn it like this now let's see the animation okay so it is coming in and then opening up place it like this okay now what you can do is again make this a compound clip so first compound clip you made for doing this masking and second time again you make the compound clip again go to mask add mask hit split on this is now hit on keyframe bring it to the start go somewhere here and drag it down okay now hit all plus k now cubic out you can select okay now what you can do is just copy this then undo the compound clip go to video from starting just cut it and bring it to this keyframe then go to video hit on mask go ahead and then open it up okay now wait on odd plus k and smoothen the animation let's bring them closer now just simple slide up animation with this green text have already provided the assets as the assets are in color so best thing to do is go to you know adjustment tab and bring down the saturation okay yes you we'll get this and then add the text so this was all for today's video just remember to download the script in the description which is provided so it by which you can also you know do the audio part so just follow the audio and add your animations how i taught you and that's it see you in the next